In this video, I want to welcome you to Mutt Practice Mode, where we're going to show you the best blitz in Madden 23 post patch. There was a patch yesterday. Wanted to do a quick video breaking down um, how to blitz, at least my personal opinion, what makes a really good blitz right now because of the way main coverage was adjusted and also because of some of the changes that were made to dollar. I do notice that dollar is a little bit less consistent and I do think it's going to continue to grow and becoming less consistent uh, year over year. Let me just show you real quick the dollar and then we'll get into the 3-3. This is out of the 46 playbook. I'm in mutt practice mode, guys. Huge day for me. I'm so excited for this. I think this is a great change. Hopefully they'll fix the practice mode thing, but whatever. Let me just get into it. So again, the dollar meta, we're going to baseline. We're going to press. We're going to stand like right in here. And we should get double edge pressure, but you notice that right side is much better at picking this up. So all they have to do to stop this blitz um, is they block their running back. We're going to show you a blitz that's going to really give this trouble uh, here in just a second. But you see here with a blocked running back. Um, they actually kind of dumbed out, but I will say, like, by and large, this is going to be fine, even if they, you know, depending on what they do, obviously they're going to, you know, occasionally come in just because that's how good dollar is year over year. But by and large, you'll see right here, if I step up, I have all the time in the world. Okay? So I want to show you 3-3 three, three Cub. Now, I do have a dollar ebook, but I also have a 3-3 three, three Cub ebook. You want to get all my ebooks, make sure you're in the Patreon. The link's in the description below. Uh, Patreon is just 10 bucks. It's going to get you access um, to everything. So, again, if you, uh, so I'd encourage you to check it out at the link down below. But let's get into this. So, 3-3 um, three, three Cub. I've been talking about this blitz a lot. Very simple. All we're going to do... We already have the safeties in here, but you might need to put the safeties in here manually. You put safeties in at nickel 3-3. Three, three. Then what you want to do is you're going to audible down to Mike Blitz 0. Mike, Mike, Mike Blitz 0, okay? Then from there, all you have to do is you're going to basically pinch your linebackers and contain. Pinching the linebackers makes all the difference in the world. You're going to stand opposite of the running back, and what you're going to see is this blitz is going to give... This offense a lot of trouble. Like, it's one of the better, in my opinion, and quicker blitzes in the game. We're going to show you what happens if they block a running back here in a second. So, again, you want to see it right here. And you see how we're getting that A gap. Now, what they're going to do to try to block this is they're going to block their running back. So, I'm going to go ahead and block my running back here. And we'll show you what this looks like. So, again, same thing. Just make sure you pinch the linebackers. I like to leave the man coverage off. You'll see he's going to loop around the running back really, really efficiently. And it's going to create incredible pressure. One of the real benefits, I think, to the 3-3 Cub, though, is when you notice they start to block their running back, I want you to drop this right side player into a zone. Whatever zone you want, you'll notice here that it's still going to come clean against a blocked running back. For the most part, there he did get picked up, but I'm telling you, um, you're going to get this to come clean a lot more than you might think. The key is an agile safety at that linebacker position that can get around the can get around the guy. So you can realistically be in a coverage, you know, that looks something like this. They block their running back, which triggers an automatic protection, and he's going to loop around him, and they're going to feel that pressure. They may not completely every time get sacked. But they're going to be able to feel that pressure in the pocket. It's going to force them to step up. They don't know that that running back is going to block him because there's been other times where you send the five man and the five man is going to come in pretty consistently. See, there gets around and sacks the quarterback. So you can send the four man on the five man. Nickel 3 3 Cub, I think, is one of the best defenses uh, right now for a lot of different reasons. And I have a 3 3 Cub ebook. I'm going to put a link to that down below. So you guys can go check that out in the Patreon. By being a Patreon member, you get access to all ebooks and all updates. Guys, Mutt Practice Mode is here. I hope that it's here to stay. It's a great feature. There's a lot you can do with it. Really excited to learn the game more in depth in practice mode. Thank you for watching the video. And if you want to get the Patreon, head down to the description and click the link down below to get all the ebooks.